The school district has basic funding from the state and every year we're seeing that funding being cut more and more. With the you know, the uh, economic crisis that we're all feeling, the reality is there are a number of unfunded programs. The schools that are in the more affluent areas are able to afford some of the extracurricular luxuries that some of the other schools aren't. Public schools need as much as we can possibly get and uh, we need more than we are given. We have a very diverse district, both socioeconomically as well as ethnically, probably second maybe even in the nation. The kids that we work with are from a low social economic background, so we're limited in the amount of money we can ask families to contribute. Poverty is significant in this area, and so they don't have all of the resources at home to help them. The fact is that I just had kids who didn't come with lots of kinds of school-ready experiences. I have kids that I worked with that had never seen a book, before they came to school. So the foundation can raise private funds to put things back in schools that maybe have been taken away. It was really established to level the playing field for the districts. We wanted to celebrate what teachers were doing in the classroom by offering financial support or resource support in other ways to allow them to be themselves and to support the efforts of, of these kids. We are never funding all that is necessary. When we give, like this year, we gave around $30,000 in Excel grants. That, that barely meets the need. We probably had double that, maybe even triple that in requests. If you've ever seen a teacher with an extra $20 bill and what that actually means to um, what they do in their classroom. But that's a very big deal for most teachers. But we've seen some really creative things in the classrooms that we're really excited about. It's pretty amazing to see what they do. They've really got researched how they can best spend that money and how they can get the very most out of their dollars. We don't think there is any contribution too small. Every dollar makes a difference in a small way. When we're doing the activities that we're, for which we've received, I've received money, my students have received money for, it's the best part of the school year. Stronger schools make a stronger community. People want to live and work and move to a community where their schools are successful. And when they see outside organizations like a foundation and a committed group of community leaders helping the schools get stronger every day, then that's a place people want to be. The needs are great for you, and the needs are great for, for all of us, but the needs are greater for our kids, the future of our country. We appreciate whatever you can do to help provide for those needs. No matter how hard they struggle, no matter how hard they fight to learn something, it's when they finally get it that makes the difference. Your dollar will help kids be able to stay in school, be able to participate in things like music, art, science and math experiences, and that they'll be connected to the school and to their community. And in the end, they'll be a better citizen for it. I feel better when I wake up in the morning because that's what giving does for you. Giving is, giving is truly getting, but, it's, but it's, a, it's a nice way of getting. It's with the help of an organization like the Highline Schools Foundation that we can help our kids reach our vision of all kids prepared for college, career, and citizenship. And who wouldn't want to be a part of making a kid's dream come true?